I have been hearing people on Twitter talk about uh, buying oil stocks because, you know, oil price is going to go up. And the, th the thesis behind this is absolutely sound, okay? But there's so many people on this trade uh, that that's what makes me worried about it because over the years, I've lost enough money on a good thesis just to lose money because everybody was already into the trade. And I always talk about that the best way to make money is to invest in a story that's not on the first page of the newspaper. It's on the 20th page, but it's moving to the first page. And so today, today I heard Jim Cramer talk about crude and energy stocks. And to me, it was like, it's on the first page of the newspaper. The first thing that came to my mind was, it's over. Like, have a listen. We don't seem to play geopolitical politics the way I would have thought. I assume you, you attribute the decline in crude today to Shanghai. Yes. And uh, not but, any kind of reserve release. No, but I think that they should stop the reserve release for now. But I think you buy crude. I think you buy the stocks because this is artificial. And uh, I'm not sure when the lockdown ends and I'm not sure when we stop uh, putting out the at the strategic power reserve. But David, I mean, you know that there's tremendous travel demand in this country. Our country is out of lockdown, 100% out of lockdown from what I can tell. So these prices are artificially down versus what I think they do. Really? You think? Yes. You, you, okay. I think we are not pumping a lot. And I think that there's tremendous activity in our country and that I don't think they fall to 80. It would be, be incredible. It'd be like, we were in lockdown. I oh. think that this is an opportunity for, for people at home to recognize that the oil companies have changed the way they distribute profits. Remember, uh, Biden ch chastised them last week for taking the money and giving it back to shareholders. But that's what they do. So please take advantage of this if you think that, uh, like I do, that our country's in, uh, the consumer is as strong. I have Matt Boss on tonight from JP Morgan. The consumer's very strong in our country. Let's not forget that. Yeah. Okay, so I 100% agree with what he's saying. But what makes me so scared about this sector is that everybody else agrees. Like I have a hard time finding anybody who is bearish on that sector right now. Like it seems to me, and correct me if I'm wrong, everybody seems to be on this trade. And so many times when everybody is in on the trade, no matter what the fundamental story behind this is, it usually doesn't turn out that great so we'll see how this turned out turns out for me i would not touch those stocks with anything uh, i just wouldn't just because i think everybody's on the same side of the trade you tell me am i right what am i missing here leave me a comment below